Hey, we're gonna give you some tips on cleaning your fuel injector, the actual fuel injector that goes inside your throttle body. Looks a lot like a carburetor for those that don't know, or a little bit like a carburetor. Got a butterfly. There's your throttle body on all the current four strokes that are out there. Your injector sits in here. Uh, it can get dirty and uh, there's really no way to hardly tell. So we clean them whenever we have the bike apart. If we're doing a motor, doing some other work. This KTM 250 XTFW, uh, similar for most of KTM's back um, for, for a while. We just pulled this one off. Out here there was just two bolts holding it on right here on the, on the rail. We pulled this off. Now in some of the bikes you can pull the injector off while it's on the bike. Some it's difficult to do. So uh, we're doing it while the engine's out of this bike. We're doing a frame up on this KTM so we have it out. So we have it here. Motion Pro has a brand new uh, tool. Kind of cool. We're going to show how to do that. Um, the first thing they say in the instructions is read the instructions first. Read all the instructions. So you read through the instructions. We're going to show you how we do it right now. Okay, so the first step, this, this tool has two spots. It has a port two and port one. Uh, we're going to do port two first, which they should maybe called it the other way around. But so you, they want to flush the injector backwards. So we're going to do it that way first. And you hold it down like this. You got these Allen bolts. And I just rigged up this on my gun so it'd be quicker to bring it down. And I don't think you have to get these things that tight. We've used this thing just a couple times. And you plug this plug into here. And what that's going to do, this button is going to open up the injector. So what we're going to do now is you get a brand new can of contact cleaner and you put the straw in. So you hit the red button and you can hear it click open. And while you do it, get that. Now we got to get our bolts a little tighter here, it looks like. And you don't want to tighten these bolts down with, you'll, you can break the injector if you put too much pressure on them. Okay, so now we're going to do this one more time. Now we're going to flip around and do, and when this go, when the straw goes inside here, you just get it in and then you snug it up. Now we're going to switch to port one. So the way they do this, this bolt has to come all the way out and then this one will spin over here and you're going to take your injector out and you're going to rig up on the other side. Now you're in port one and now you're going to shoot it off the way it would be in the motor in the throttle body. So it goes in here like so and you bring your plate down to where it touches and I'm gonna I'm gonna bring the I think you want to be really careful doing that. Also I just noticed that our seal under here is getting caught so I want to get over the seal and then just take these down by hand down here like so. So now I'm, I'm dialed down in port one. I hit the button and you can see the spray. And that's kind of what it sprays into your motor, just like that. And you can see it's a nice even through all the holes. It is making a big mess of contact cleaner everywhere. Does that look cool, Kyle? Yeah. Going up, it's like this nice, cool fog. Probably not good to do this forever, but it looks really cool. So are you zoomed in here? Let's check this thing out. Look at this. That's like, so that's all there is to it. So now that I've unplugged it, I can back off the bolts. I back the bolts off like this, and I can pull the injector off. Now there's different cables here. This one is for our KTM one, and you're gonna need a different cable for a few others. So on this one, we're good to go. The replacement battery goes right in here. Uh, it's a nine volt battery, I believe is what we put in there. Anyway, it's been a while. So batteries in here, really pretty cool tool. Uh, for those mechanics that are working on a few bikes and want to make sure that their, that their fuel injector is clean, a good way to check it out right here. <laughs>